it? I see her by the cliff. You? I'm Sylph, a free roaming traveler. Give me my dress back, Sylph. No! If I do, the ceremony will begin. And then Orica will be bound to Liner. What are you talking about? The ceremony is for the two of you to exchange vows. Orica, if you attend the ceremony, you won't be able to live your life freely anymore. What? That's what the ceremony is all about? Is it? Orica, you've lived your entire life alone. You might find it difficult to live with someone for the rest of your life. You won't be able to make your own decisions. You just won't be free. You might not even be able to be alone whenever you want to. Do you want to throw away your freedom just to go through with this? Well... I still want to have the ceremony with Liner. Orca. I may not be free, but I can still do things that I like. Plus, I can do other things that I couldn't do with him before. So, you've made up your mind. Then I won't say anything. I'll give your dress back. But I still have one more thing to say. You still miss your freedom. Liner, when she starts to feel that way, please let her be free for a while. Sure, of course. Orica, don't be afraid to be honest with him. And tell him when you want to be alone. I will. I promise. It feels great to let out all of my emotions. Oh, now I feel much better. Good luck, you two. My dress. Great. Now you can go back to your room and change. All right. She sure is taking a long time. Thank you for waiting. So, how do I look? Do I look funny? No, you look beautiful. Really? Thank you. Come on, let's go to the church for our ceremony. Yes, dear. point to the tower? Yes. Didn't you know that a Ravatail's Cosmosphere is connected to the tower's binary field? They're connected right here on level 9. By connecting her to the tower directly, she can boost her power significantly. Now she can access the tower directly. It's their greatest power. Now, Let's begin the ceremony. <coughs> Orica Nest Meal. Yes? Do you promise to love and support 
short liner and to stay by his side forever. What? I... I, I do. Liner Barset. So now it's my turn to make promises? Liner, you've helped Orica down her path of development. Do you promise to support her emotionally so as to maintain peace in the Cosmosphere? Sure, why not? Good. Now, hug Orica to solidify your vow. Do I really have to hug her? Yes, it's of utmost importance. The Cosmosphere is very delicate. It'll leave a huge scar on her psyche if you don't. Orica needs to maintain a strong, healthy connection with the person who helped her develop. Where a man and woman help, support, and improve each other. That's the kind of relationship you and Orica must create. Liner? Yes? Getting nervous. Me too. Thank you for everything. I never knew I possessed so much hidden power. I was only able to discover it because you believed in me and always stayed by my side. I want to be with you forever. Now that you've exchanged vows, let's go get the power. You mean she hasn't gotten it yet? No. First she must touch the tower. Come on! Here we are. Are we inside? Yes. This tower acts like an umbilical cord, connecting Ravatails to Artanelico. The binary field is just around the corner. Really? I thought the tower has always been here. You may have seen it on a lower level, but you couldn't access it before. It may have seemed close, but you couldn't reach it. Not anymore. By touching the tower, Orica can access her greatest power. She'll be able to access the tower directly. Access directly? Yes. She used to absorb power from the tower to turn into song magic. But she couldn't affect the tower. That's all about to change. She'll be able to affect the tower by crafting her feelings. Cool. Now, Orica, go touch the tower. Okay. crystal inside me. You're right. Thank you for staying all the way to the end. But this isn't the end. It's just a new beginning. Yeah, you're right. I can go on forever.